Well, still in Boucher State, there are no fewer than 467 ad hoc staff engaged by the National Population Commission NPC for the 2023 Census. Exercise in Boucher State has yet to receive their allowances, a development which has sent them to the street to protest the non payment of their allowances. Well, the spokesman of the ad hoc staff, Abbas Adamu, while addressing the state director of the commission and staff in Boucher state says they have done the job diligently but are yet to receive their due allowances. Well, about your state correspondent, Hawa Hassan completes the story. Entitlement. Let us our entitlement. We need our entitlement. They are not These are among the 467 ad hoc staff employed by the National Population Commission to provide support during the forthcoming 2023 census. <laughs> They are yet to receive their due allowances, which is why they took to the streets, heading to the commission's office to express their grievances. Along the way, some of the staff of the commission were spotted by the protesters, who assumed they were planning to escape, a situation that caused chaos. A while later, the protestants convinced the commission staff to reverse to the office where they presented their complaints. Payment of the allowances of the trainees was effected about two months ago. Some got their payment, others did not. Now, uh, the worrying part of it is that uh, there seems to be no clear cut explanation as to why there is this uh, unexplainable delay in the payment of those who have taken part in the exercise, who trained in Bauchi State. Some came from different locations, from far distances. The protesting ad hoc staff claimed they were only demanding a clear explanation of why some of them are yet to receive their allowances. I know people who had to sleep at the training center in the classrooms didn't have money to feed, had to sell some of their properties in order to participate in the training. Yes. Now, the commonest, the simplest thing is one would expect that instead of allowing rumors to fly around, mm. the commission should come out openly and make a categorical statement mm. about the payment of those who took part in the exercise but have not been paid. Responding. The state director of the National Population Commission lauded the ad hoc staff for carrying out the protest in a simple and violence-free manner. I want to receive the complaints from the trainee facilitators who have not gotten their pay. Uh, I'm going to forward it to the Honorable Federal Commissioner. But I want to make it in point that this is not the first time we've been trying to address this issue. I've seen so many faces here that came to me personally and in group, and we discussed this. I'm so surprised that probably they were not satisfied with the efforts my Honorable Federal Commissioner has been making, and that's why they had to come themselves. But I want to thank them for being very civil in the way they are agitating for what they perceive is their rights. Reports indicate that the protesting staff members had been hired by the National Population Commission to provide support for the 2023 census exercise in the state. But in Bauchi State, 467 are yet to receive their allowances. Awol Hassan, Viewer TV News, Bauchi.